Hey everyone, welcome to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Well, it's been a long time coming this game. I've been hyped as hell uh, to get this game started and now we're actually here. The latest From Software game. So yeah, I'm gonna try and waste as little time in the menus as possible and get to the gameplay. As we've discussed, uh, this is going to be a standard playthrough as in the normal type of video recording that I used to do on my channel instead of a stream because I want to give the best possible experience for you guys you know and streaming doesn't always happen like that but yeah intro cutscene I'm assuming so I'm gonna go ahead and try shutting the fuck up you know I have a difficult time doing that but <laughs> Is that a Zambo? Oh no, that's a almost dead dude. So this game does have some historical context from what I'm understanding. And the game is supposed to have like a more understandable story too. Pretty sure I fought this battle in Neo already. Didn't look as flashy though. Now I'm gonna actually pay attention to the story here because with Neo I got lost like an idiot, so I tried, you know. I'll try fixing that for this game. That's us, right? Oh no, that's not us. I have no idea. That is us. That, that dude looks badass. He's like the th samurai Thor or something, or like Odin. Man, this game is looking nice. That Activision budget though. All right, I'm itching to get started. I'm itching. In terms of the length of these episodes, I'm gonna keep it standard, like 40 minutes around that mark. Sometimes going over, sometimes under, depending on how I can proceed. You know, you know the drill. Are we the wolf? Because if we are, that's kind of edgy, isn't it? Are we a furry?
It looks like that vam vampire bitch from Neo. And this is a familiar intro, isn't it? It's someone dropping something down. A hole. That is us. We are the wolf, aren't we? But we look kind of dead. Half dead. And we still got our arm, I'm noticing. And I'm assuming that's not going to be sticking around for very long. Yes, we know about the arm mechanic. Who doesn't? Alright, let's get started here. This is familiar. Let her not thrown into the well. Kuro's wolf, your destiny awaits you at the moon view tower. Escape from the well and find the tower, tower bathed in moonlight. Alright, stealth section. Oh, it's not a run. Okay. It's stealth. Because you kind of run by default in this game. Okay, cool. However, this is a Souls game. So, there's probably something on the other side of this. And, oh, you can swim. Nice. You can do a little dolphin dive, too. Okay. You can even like dodge in the water. Is there any way to go under? Okay. So either. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Probably there's a way to get there, but apparently I'm not smart enough. I don't want to waste too much time, but yeah. So as you can see, you can kind of move quickly by default in this game so and yeah, the jumping I really like the idea of the jumping because you know as much as I like the souls formula oh it's gonna be this way isn't it to be honest I think it's safe to say that the formula was getting a little stale damn I really thought I was being clever As in, you know, that's a fine style of gameplay, but there's only so many games you can have that play like that. And this looks like the perfect shake-up for the formula, because even Bloodborne, you know, didn't shake up the core uh, idea this much. You don't have a sword at the moment, use stealth, avoid enemies, head to the moon view tower. Okay, there's warning markers. Because let me tell you, I... Did I get spotted? Are you kidding me? Oh man, I was just about to say that I do like me some stealth however let me tell you this I've played Metal Gear Solid I know the deal I guess a music accompaniment at least I think I've successfully fleed god I mean I cannot believe I failed the first fucking stealth section I'm an idiot I wasn't paying attention to the marker. Jump in air near ledge, ledge hang. Sounds like a plan. I like how they're focusing more on the platforming aspect here because I think they're assuming that at this point everybody knows how to play a Souls game. Or at least has some idea. Okay, I think we've escaped from leader, what's his name? Fuck, I can't believe I failed the first stealth section. It's all good though. Oh, hello. Oh, 
He is a furry, isn't he? I knew it. Shouldn't it be my lady? Although, maybe they just... Oh, okay. Every good Japanese sword should be named. Please don't tell me this thing is an escort mission. I, I mean, I know it's not. But still. Good to mess with the idea at least. Souls escort mission. That would be hell, wouldn't it? Katana given by Kuro the divine heir. An heirloom of the Hirata family. One star lost. Hands of the wolf. Shinobi's role is to kill, but even a Shinobi must not forget mercy. Alright. I got plenty of mercy, I think. They actually have a kid in a Souls game. We were just talking about it, uh, healing gourd. Okay, okay, okay. Estus flasks. Do we have amnesia? So yeah, we were just talking about it in one of my streams, uh, which by the way, you, you guys know, I stream. Or if you don't, I stream quite frequently. I missed th something about the bridge under the castle. This is why I, I don't babble during cutscenes. What? Sounds like a plan. Alright. Quick item, cycle quick items. Wait, it goes this way? Alright. Yep. Oh yeah, and apparently you can pause this game now, which is interesting. Held by the wolf ever since he was saved by his fa father, it concerns him. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's a homeward bone, isn't it? Alright, so, as I was saying, I stream frequently. Right now I'm playing Dark Souls 1 using only a croc. Fuck, I can't even talk. Crossbow. Okay. Is that... Is that basically a whatchamacallit? A live gem? Okay, yeah, yeah. That to me, sure as hell, sounds like a live gem. Only one healing item so far, but apparently it refills. Alright. Oh, yeah, I should. I should use it too. Which is done by. Uh. Fuck, I wasn't paying attention. Which is done by... Oops. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I'm sure as hell... Okay. I sure as hell would like to heal myself. Oh, fuck, it's like that. Okay, whatever, I use the other thing. Okay, R1 is to attack. Okay. Okay, that's how you dodge, cool. 
like circle is it still circle cool all right well that was a rough beginning so this but wait why doesn't it work on this how weird is that oh okay weird all right whatever because it was down for the other one uh, never mind L1 moment of the attack is deflect sure as hell looks like a parry to me come on nice we got there we got there took a while it's gonna be difficult getting used to this combat style as in like not Perry not being L2 and, you know, all that. Do we have heavy attacks, actually? It doesn't look like we do. Yes, okay. So what what would happen? If I did a little sneak up on this bitch. Yeah, eat shit. I knew it. Man, I love stealth. I am a big fan of stealth. I mentioned this, right? That I'm a big fan of stealth. Because I feel like it offers interesting possibilities. No, I, I didn't mean to do that. Well, actually, can't I? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Because there are some dudes here, and I was just thinking if it's... No, we can't. Oh, yes, we can. Because I was just thinking, from a tactical perspective, how much better it is to... Please tell me this works. It didn't. Okay, drop attacks. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Oh, these look sick, these finishers. They got they got them right. I was worried about the finishers. Because I was like, they're going to make them too long, aren't they? But they it looks like they took the doom path. Where they happen very quickly. Very god. You know that I like parrying as well. No experience so far. Oh wait, th this game doesn't even have leveling. What the fuck am I talking about? I'm gonna assume that we will be able to do shit here with the... Uh, the grappling hook later. Because... A counter slash can be performed immediately after defending and deflecting an attack. So that allows you to deal posture damage without... Giving the enemy time to recover. L on the moment attack lands deflect. R1 after deflecting counter slash. Oh, I'm assuming this is for enemies that you cannot... This is for enemies you cannot, like, uh, immediately kill. Oops, the boy got slashed. <laughs> it just says death. <laughs> okay, I like that. I like that. Just says death. Not even you. You died or nah. Let's not. Let's not fuck around with that. Just death. Sounds good. I'll watch this stealth. Fuck, it didn't work. I was really hoping for stealth. Oh, you can get hit. Okay. I was just about to say, can you get hit in animations? And it looks like the answer to that is yes. Well, we had our first death. It's all good, though. Look at this. Already, we are doing way, way better than before. So what I did here, is I did a sneak. 
I'm gonna try that drop attack again because... Oh, these look sick. I'm so glad they went with this, as in these kill animations, and they took the, took the, took the Doom path. Never mind the fact that I can't talk. Oh, what if I... Oh, but then all those other dudes are gonna be attracted. If I don't kill them. So can't I... Please tell me there is drop attacks in this game. Drop attacks are my favorite. I'm, I'm, I'm in such a Neo. I think it's just the samurai stuff, because I keep trying to dodge with R1. Not R1, X, I mean. Which is like such a Neo thing. Come on, bitch. Parry this idiot. Got the best parries. And I have a healing item for this. This is ain't even a boss. It's just a dude. Okay, let's figure out this counter slash. Okay, just I got greedy. Oh yeah. Oh, they have multiple... Okay. Some powerful opponents require multiple death blows to be killed. The number of death blows required to kill an enemy is shown on the red... Yeah, okay. Kind of figured that. You know what? I ain't fucking around. Let me heal. Oh, he has big reach. Oh, shit. <laughs> he knocked me down. I'm about to get death blown. I'm just... I feel like this counter slash mechanic I've not gotten yet, but... Maybe I have. I don't know. Okay. I think the idea is similar to the live gem stuff, right? That you use these outside of battle and the healing gourd in battle. I just hope it won't be the same issue as in Dark Souls 2. Ash gripped into a hardened clump. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Alright. Already finding that secret passage, I think. So what was I saying? Oh yeah, so I just hope that it's not going to be... Yeah, we for sure need a grappling hook for this. It's not going to be the same as uh, Dark Souls 2 where the normal healing item was just like available way too often as in live gems and Estus took a took a back turn you know oh we can eavesdrop okay this is cool it's straight up Samurai Metal Gear Solid. I don't know, like, I was looking at that other game, Ghosts of Tsushima, or whatever it's called. What is gonna be the difference between this game and that? Look at this little bitch. What the hell is that? It's like a weird... Look at that thing. Looks like a ball sack. Okay, looks like the path. Just to be sure. That looks like the path too as well though. Nah, it's not. I was saying. Uh, yeah, straight up Metal Gear Solid. But I don't know what what the actual difference between this game and Ghost of Tsushima is gonna be like. Tsushima, I think that's what it's called. Pretty much looking like the exact same. I know that one is more open world. I know, I know. I'm just, just fucking around, you know. But seriously, though, how many samurai games have there been lately? It's becoming the genre. Isn't that the statue you use to uh, pause the game? Yeah, we will. 
She's gonna be sneaking through as well. Oh, she just appears. Cool. Is that a... That's a girl though, right? I think it is. Yeah, that's yes, for sure a chick. Alright. But you see, he says my lord. I don't know. Unsure. Again, we were just talking about uh, having children in Souls games. It's weird. But assuming you won't be able to hurt her. Okay. Alright. But this is kind of reminiscent. I'm assuming it is reminiscent of... Uh, how that was supposed to be... I'm just trying to pay attention. How there was a, supposed to be a child, um, Emerald Herald in Dark Souls 2. Is she coming after us? Yes, she is. Okay, let's not run too far ahead. Oh, shit. There's a dude there. Oh, this is just straight up Neo, isn't it? But better looking. I mean, Neo is a few years older. So, can't exactly clown on Neo. It's a good game. Oh, shit. Ghost Grass. A la Game of Thrones. Holy shit. Oh shit. That Nippon steel. I mean, you weren't sure he was gonna be trying to kill us, right? Although if you're standing in a field like this, all anime, of course you are. Tutorial boss? Sounds cool. He looks more well equipped than I am. I'm just gonna put that out there. That insane. The same looking. Oh shit. The same looking too hot right now. He only needs two. What the hell? Oh. I don't know what that was. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, you're supposed to lose to him. Because he cuts off the arm. I don't know what that other symbol was. He has a bow as well? God damn. Well, this shinobi is a noob. Watch me on my fourth playthrough. Your ass is gonna be destroyed. What the hell is that? I'm assuming we're gonna kick these guys' asses later on. Probably. Getting revenge is always good. I don't know what that other symbol was that like glowed above my head. Assuming there's more to this game than what we've seen so far, as in in terms of combat. This is a, that's a crusty ass dude. It's such a gross word, crusty. The connotation of it. Still don't know why half our face looks undead like that. Looks like we're going hollow or some shit. Oh yeah. We are robot. Oh, 
の定めではないと見える。Crusty. That's all I can say. Shinobi prosthetic, an artificial arm of a shinobi passed down from the sculptor, a replica of a human arm fitted with a variety of mechanisms. All right. It has been impeccably maintained. What is this? Save point, right? Okay. Very cryptic. Very cryptic, boys. I was gonna say exactly the same thing. I like that, again, I like that we actually have a main character. This, there is nothing wrong with this. Same as with Neo. We don't have an ugly ass character creation, you know. So it's so much more focus allowed for characterization. All right, Krusty. A little bit, a little sus. Cryptic again. Oh, it is a okay. Never mind, ignore what I said previously. Sometimes it's difficult to tell with these samurai games. Even in Neo, like, some of those dudes had weird ass haircuts and it was difficult to, like, distinguish. That looks that thing looks cool. It's better. Alright, so he's gonna be the hub. Or he's gonna be the Andre. I know you can't upgrade your weapons, but I know there's like little Modifications. Yeah. We got one more question. Mass Effect style. The wolf and the dragon, god damn, this is like a furry convention. Alright. This is going to be our hub, isn't it? Think I get along with you as well, pretty well. Not going to lie. I still don't know what the fuck this is supposed to be, but it's all good. Man, this game looks nice. I'm liking the the aesthetics, the vision. All right. 
we got healing and we got our first save point sculptors either serve as checkpoints completely replenishing vitality and restore one use of resurrection oh shit we have are we gill additionally quick items and spirit em emblems in storage will be added to your current inventory resting will also revive fallen enemies with some exceptions of course being uh whatchamacallit bosses cool we rested up He's, he mentioned that there's another NPC here. Uh, we will look for that boy slash girl. Why does he always have his sword out menacingly? Oh yeah, we got the grappling hook. We got that, we got that. Do you like me a grappling hook? We'll try all of that in just a, just a minute. It's not an enemy, is it? No, that's the other dude. Hello? He just doesn't say it. Afraid to admit, isn't he? Face you in bat. Oh, fuck. Man, I'm so. I need to get off this Neo. <laughs> Just don't kill him. Jeez. Alright, he's undead, isn't he? Oh, he wants to die. Can we put away our sword somehow? I don't know. Glad you're happy. I knew there were undead in this game. What would a Souls game or Soul style game be without undead? Some form of undead. <laughs> Just use me for sword practice. Sounds like a plan. If you want to die, say indeed. Training. Practice the basics of deflection. This is the one. Sometimes relentless attack is not enough to break an enemy's posture. Okay. Yeah, it's the timing, isn't it, for me? Too late. There we go. Yeah. Cool. I think we got that. Okay. I was just like, how do you end this? But it's all good. Alright, let's do the step dodging one. As well. Just to make sure. Evade enemy attacks, then attack and perform three death blows. After do dodge counter. Okay. Is that one? Sure as hell dodging. Oh shit. I got hit. That was a backstab though, wasn't it? Oh, what the hell? Hold on. 
That's a weird... Okay, we need that move. It's interesting. You see how, like... I'm not holding a direction there. Like... It's almost like the, some part of the dodging is automatic because, see, I'm not pushing forward when I'm doing that. It's really interesting. Huh. Strange. All good. All good. I think we got the gist of it. Yeah, this is we're gonna be able to use him. Offering box items that become unavailable elsewhere end up in the offering. Okay. I like that there's actually an explanation for that, unlike <clears throat> Dark Souls One, where there was a random chest and nobody had any idea what it did. Well, it's if you lose a key item. All right, I'm gonna save. I don't know why. And with that, I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up episode one of. I almost said Neo. I almost literally said episode one of Neo, but episode one of Sekiro: Shadows Die Twice. Man, this game is fun. I'm liking the stealth. Uh, in terms of a path, I'm gonna try. Oh wait, we have one more NPC to talk to. Hello. Is that our waifu? Emma, it's a very ordinary name, not like wolf and shit. Cinematic camera from the boy. She's gonna be able to upgrade that. She's gonna be the Estus Flask of the upgrader, isn't she? It's like a ball sack, isn't it? Told you. Yup, flash shards. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. I don't think we have one at this point. All right. Now, I was going to say, but now I'm really saying it. Time to wrap up episode one of Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Yeah, this is a, this is looking good. What better way is there to shake up the for Souls formula than Samurai's, right? Again, in terms of run, style, I'll try go stealth. I like me some stealth. Like me some Metal Gear Solid slash Dishonored. And yeah, if I can sneak around, I'll try doing that. But I'm assuming I'll fail miserably at it. So thanks for watching. Are there gestures in this game? I'm assuming not because there is no PvP, so there's no point really to gesturing. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed episode one of Sekiro. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, do all that if you, well, not if you want to see more, but if you want to stay kind of caught up on when I'm uploading. There will be one more episode of this game today for sure, because how can I resist? So yeah, peace out guys and see you next time. Goodbye.